For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. I have this amazing story to tell you about a man named Benaiah. Benaiah was a general in King David's royal army. Benaiah had worked his way up in David's army. And at this point in the story, Benaiah was the chief of David's bodyguards, the warrior closest to King David himself. In order to achieve the status that Benaiah had, we know that he had to have grown through the ranks by defeating many opponents. The scripture tells us that Benaiah took on an Egyptian giant and killed the man with his own spear. The scripture also tells us that he went two against one with two great Moabite warriors and defeated both men in one fight. Without a doubt, Benaiah was one of the greatest warriors in the history of battle. In today's story, Benaiah chases an angry, dangerous lion into a deep, dark cat. The real question for the day is why did Benaiah chase a lion into a cave? The scripture does not give us the exact answer to that question. But we do know a few things about David's mighty men. The first thing that we know is that David's men never chose to do something or go into a battle for their own benefit. They always chose the fight that most benefited David or David's people. The most likely scenario was that this lion endangered the people in David's kingdom. And Benaiah was strong enough, brave enough, and valiant enough to risk his own life to guarantee that someone else would not have to face this threat. My question for you today is this. Are you willing to risk yourself to kill someone else's lion? Here, 